Hey, what is going on guys and welcome back to Too Much Tech and in today's video we're going to be checking out the C3 Equals and the Key Company's new linear switches called the Banana Split Switches. Huge shout out to the Key Company for sending out these Banana Split Switches for testing and I actually like them quite a bit. I will probably buy some more while they're still in stock. I don't know. We'll see if I need any more for another board or so, but I should probably not impulse buy more switches than I need, right? So these switches are manufactured by JWK, but the housings are designed by C3 Equals. So the housings, the molds, everything is brand new. Nothing is recolored from previous JWK switches. These switches are made from a yellow palm stem as well as a pink and purple top and bottom housing made from polycarbonate and nylon. And these switches are also lightly lubed from the factory as well. I don't know exactly what kind of lube it is, but you are able to lube over it if you think that there's not enough lube, but I think that the amount that they apply is actually pretty generous. It's not too, too much where the switch feels like it's over lube. It's actually quite the opposite. It's just enough so that it glides a little bit better and it also resonates better as well. The sound profile is a lot more high pitched than something that's made from ABS or Palm. So I actually like that quite a bit because it gives it a little bit more of a clacking sound rather than a thocky deeper sounding switch. I like these a lot because it's a really lazy-ish, relaxed, very smooth stock switch. Like the 67 gram spring is a perfect weight. The spring is actually gold as well. So you do have good aesthetics inside and out. Like these are one of the best looking switches I can confidently say that are available on the market today. And if you're interested in a really good linear switch that you don't have to do anything to, that you can just drop into a board, whether it be hot swap or soldered, you will not be disappointed with your purchase. Like these are some of the best switches to come out all year. There are 1625 for a pack of 25 switches. And so the pricing is very reasonable as well. It's a lot cheaper than Zeal switches. And the performance I do have to say is very similar. The switch wobble, there is a little bit of wobble, but it's nothing that would uh, mess you up during typing or gaming. So it's nothing to worry about. But yeah, I would definitely recommend these to someone that's looking for a new keyboard switch that's gonna be different than something you've probably heard on the market. If I had to relate it to anything, I would say that it's somewhat similar to a Gateron Yellow, but like better in every way. And the pitch is just perfect. You guys will hear it in the sound test at the end of the video, but that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys enjoy, be sure to drop a like and subscribe. If you are new to the channel, I'm gonna leave you guys with the build as well as a pretty long sound test at the end. I'll see ya. Keep